Hey there, welcome back. Uh, in this video about the Apprentice S15E ready to fly airplane, we're, in, we're going to install the push rods for the ailerons. Okay, I want to do this now before I assemble because I think it's going to be easier. So I'm going to put this up on my stand like this, airplane's over there. The first thing I'm going to do is I don't want this moving around while I'm um, putting the push rod on. So I'm going to take some blue painter's tape and tape this so that it is not going to move and is centered. So that the aileron is centered with the first part of the wing here. I'm actually going to do that on both ends. That way, as I um, move the, uh, trying to put the clevis in, this won't move and it'll be where I want. <clears throat> okay? So, the next thing is, do we need to use my favorite tool here, my clevis um, tool, form one tool it's called, but this part is the clevis part. Um, so, <clears throat> will it fit without any changes? Hmm. Pretty close. I'll tell you what, we're going to try, try it. This might be a short video. <laughs> okay. So, let's see how that works. Close this. That's funny that this particular clevis, watch this, is really springs out and doesn't come springs out pretty easily and most of them stay locked in this one's not doing that but that's okay that's why we have this clevis keeper piece of silicone tubing I'll push it up like that not all the way to the control okay not all the way to the control horn you can see the clevis the white clevis keeper right there so it's not all the way to the control horn. There's a little bit of gap between the control horn and the clevis keeper. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so that was easy enough. By the way, um, if you don't recognize what these are, let me show you this. Um, this little bump here is called a droop. Okay. Most wings don't have droops. This airplane does, and it makes it fly nicer. It, it, prevents tip stalls and, and lets it have a slower stall speed and all kinds of stuff. So most most of the time a wing, the leading edge of the wing is straight all the way across. This bumps up and has a different uh, angle to it for, for a little bit. That's what prevents the wing uh, tip stalls. So now that that's in place, I'm going to take the tape off. So I got the push rod for the aileron in place. Aileron in place. Okay. So now I'm going to take that off. That's pretty straight. Now sometimes this and this. So. This end matches well. This end is slightly off. Okay, so that end is just slightly off. That's okay. It's not going anywhere. All right. So, I think that's good. Um, I won't do the second one. The second one's identical to the first one. Uh, thank you for watching. Stay tuned for the next video.